fellow uh, going to show you uh, about fuel and uh, freighter and missions. Uh, I am on my freighter, just landed. I am going to check out my ships which I sent a mission earlier. Uh, you have to make this room on your carrier to be able to do things. Ok, now I will check. I will later explain how to start them, how to start missions. So I was sending uh, my my team of these five ships to a second uh, difficulty tier uh, mission and now they, they debrief me what they acquired so it's dirty bron bronze superconducting something then it's uh, Gecknip and Terra Cobalt, Grantine Gek Relic, ok, ending mission now they are available again I'm going to show you them later I think at first now these are mm, these things they are they are acquired are dropped in freighter freighter's uh, inventory I will transfer all this stuff to Exosuit to sell Fine. So, when you buy a ship, you have this this uh, menu enabled, manage fleet. Press it, and you will see you see here ships what uh, accompany your carrier. Uh, for example, a, a bit of uh, uh, I have a bit advanced ship already because I have sent them to missions and they acquire new levels. At the beginning most of them are C or maybe B, some, some are B. So at uh, the first I had one ship, I don't remember which one. Uh, each ship has role. Let's say this ship is a fighter. Uh, as you can see, combat strength 21, well, and so on. Uh, I got one ship with my carrier, later I bought other ships, and I tried to have all, uh, let's say, all specializations for them. Uh, uh, you have, you can have max 30 ships as far as I know. So you can send 5 to each mission or 1 to each mission if you don't have. So here you can see them. Anyway, let's go ahead. Uh, once you check this thing, you go uh, to navigator guy and he has potential missions, expeditions. Uh, here you can see what kind of missions these are. For example, if you have a single trade ship or single explorer ship, I would recommend uh, go to as possible lowest uh, difficulty missions, especially because uh, you maybe will have only one one this uh, ship you see uh, they they floating around here you can see them so you g you choose mission then you can assign ships here for example if you have one ship combat ship let's say i i assigned it then i press return uh, and then I can choose the launch mission. F 
for a launch mission I need fuel you see this fuel uh, so you have to create create uh, fuel he will give you a blueprint mm, okay I will not send this ship uh, but this guy will give you uh, blueprint for free as you speak to hi uh, speak with to him okay now fuel here is on freighter I have created already some fuel you need two things dehydrogen and tritium Bo uh, both things you can just buy and they are very cheap really really cheap so you have three types of fuel 200 tons 50 and 100 fine now with hydrogen uh, you buy these things in trading ports or from NPC pilots once you get these things you can use uh, this refiner or not matter which refiner you add this hydrogen jelly and it will give you f one thing will give you 50 uh, dehydrogen okay so let's do this 15 dihydrogen I go to freighter so now on freighter I can create another 200 tons fuel as you see cost uh, 80,000 units ok here it is uh, when your ships will, will go to the mission you will see here the progress I will send full expedition right now to show you how this ga happens how this is done ok I will go to you see these I, I don't want 4 hours to wait ok 1 hour one and a half hour ok now I will assign as leading ship I don't know if this matter but as leading ship I try to assign uh, that type of that speciality what speciality mission is but here is balanced mission it's no it has no speciality I will give lead to combat unit second combat unit and then all others ok now they are on the mission and their fleet rating it's important you see their fle fleet rating is 5 mission difficulty was 2 so it means uh, it's very low chance you will have to make repairs if your mission is uh, higher than your fleet rating it's possible that you your ships will sustain damage okay now I will launch expedition with uh, 100 tons of fuel off they go I want s uh, I will not be able to show them now in space these ships but here they are so here you can see what is going on in your mission inspect ships and you see ship damage times okay now let's go out and I hope I will be able to show you how to hire these ships how to buy them it's actually all very easy I think so you need to see freighter is presented somewhere hard to see this way 
Uh, freighter, freighter. I don't see any freighter. And this auto docking. Need to wait in space a bit for freighter. When freighter will arrive, uh, NPC freighter. With that NPC freighter will arrive other ships. These accompany ships, whatever they are called. Here, you see? Here they are, let's fly there. Okay, here are these uh, green signs I will switch back to front view. Okay, we buy closer and you hear these ticks and you can see on the right bottom corner you have incoming call. Okay, let's go closer. So closest ship will give you this incoming call. Let's uh, say hello. Okay, this gag ship is uh, available to buy. Let's check what kind of ship is this and what level. Mm -hmm. So two millions and it it is combat unit. So you, this way you can back, uh, buy it, and it will automatically join your your carrier. Let's see another unit. Inspect. Okay, this is industrial unit, low level, but B, B support specialist, alright. So, uncalibrated war drive, uh, you should not buy this. If it has a problem, I was not able to solve that problem, maybe you will see one of my ship had uh, a red dot and uh, I bought ship with this problem and I did not know I should not buy this okay so here we are I hope you understand bye